Jason M. What's up guys, Jason I'm here with a quick video. I want to show you guys actually my experience to run Lollipop and um, so many people spoke about memory leak issues on Lollipop and I actually don't know what's happening with their devices. Um, it appears Google has some memory leak issues with devices like the Nexus 5 and all its Nexus devices. I don't know what's happening but I said they got it fixed with Android 5.1 and things like that. But this is actually my Xperia Z2 running um, Android 5.0.2 Lollipop as you guys can see here. Um, actually I haven't gotten any of these memory leak issues. Um, I think Sony fixed it themselves or they found a way to optimize um, the device in such a way that it doesn't really have these memory leak issues. Because if I show you what's going on here, you can see I've got um, 1.3 GB left just now and my apps are using how much that's about 800 and then you can see the system is about 600 or something. So I'm about 1.3 GB safe. Usually the memory leak issues cause the device to use a lot more RAM than it should be using. And I can actually show you here, my recent apps has a lot of apps. So many apps. Extremely a lot of apps. A lot of them. But yet I've got no issues here. And this is how I've been working my Z3 every day. Um, I've got no memory leak issues here. So... Um, when with people complaining about having memory leak issues in the whole of Android 5.0 or whatsoever, my Xperia Z3 hasn't gotten that. Um, so let me get your thoughts. But I think the Xperia line is safe from this. Sony has gotten a way around this surely, and um, I think this is great. So um, leave a thumbs up for this video if you like it, and subscribe for more my channel.